So working really closely with local authorities, uh, other commissioners um, and employers across GM to support young people's pathways and progression into their future careers and, uh, and obviously meeting their aspirations. I think what sets us aside is uh, we're supporting uh, almost as an alternative into the college network by uh, by looking at the environment that we teach in, the, the sectors that we deliver in and making sure that it's an environment that suits individuals where colleges or larger institutions may not may not suit. We've done an awful lot of uh, analysis to look at where the skills gaps are. We've aligned that with the current needs but also future needs. Um, that we're constantly reviewing the skills needs and skills gaps. You know, we've already done a huge part of that and, and the priority areas um, that, that include many of our provision areas, so we're already delivering in those areas where we know there's going to be demand in the future. So we obviously need to make sure that we're still engaging, um, tailoring and, and changing provision to ensure that we are currently delivering what is the, the need for the here and now and the future. Um, I think one of the things for the for the here and now and for the future is um, trying to make sure that we are very tailored in our approach and focused in, in what we deliver and deliver it well. Um, but as part and parcel of that, we are in GC in a position where we can bring together specialist organisations to really, really delve into the community and deliver the best possible provision in that particular area. So in relation to some of the, the partners, and we have multiple partners across uh, GC and obviously within GC Education and Skills, examples are in our digital boot camp, so we work with some fantastic uh, partners in UA92 and UK Skills Academy, who ultimately are, are delivering specialist areas um, that we can then add on to our, our provision and support um, basically local uh, development skills. Um, in addition, in, um, we work with some fantastic large employers, and that is very much around the uh, NHS, basically uh, areas across GM, who are in a position there where we can upskill their staff and we've got a really really supportive employer who uh, who enables us to work with them to develop skills and then it is the local authorities we you know our training centers uh, are absolutely embedded within the local authorities looking at the needs of individuals tailoring our provision of what they need and, and want and looking to the future prime example is the opening of our uh, new Wigan site which was basically in conjunction with seeing a demand for for construction skills within that area and and as I said it is across the board and the development of partnerships within our technical area, within our skill centre and the, and the Green Skills Academy have meant that employers are coming to us looking at what they need for their business. Uh, not that we're going to them saying this is all we can deliver, it is actually what do you need, how can we tailor that within funding streams um, and commercial uh, provision for them. So across the board we have multiple organisations that we partner with, a long-standing one with Bolton University with regards to our HE provision which goes from strength to strength each year. Um, I genuinely think the future is collaboration and making sure that uh, collectively we're in a position to, to give a breadth of provision, but specialist provision by those partners. A lot of times we uh, we take probably for, for granted, um, obviously what we do, um, but it is something which is extremely rewarding. Um, we have a huge amount of people who are massively passionate about delivering and, and developing skills and helping people. The biggest um, sort of success stories are those people who've, who've overcome massive amounts of challenges in their educational uh, journey thus far, who are then progressing into work, listening to uh, how they've overcome challenges that they've uh, basically had over the years. We deliver well, we deliver what we know, want and are passionate about and it gives us a huge opportunity to grow but also grow through quality and I think that is something which the next two years will hopefully give us focus and uh, direction of travel. Massive thanks for all the hard work that they do. Without the cliche, as we change people's lives because of what people do on a day-to-day -day basis and just uh, massively proud to be part of it.